Hi, it's Bobby, founder and director of San Diego's Lions, Tigers, and Bears, and I'm here with Callie today and finally going to give you an update. I'm sorry it's taken so long, but as you can see, she's doing really, really well, and you know, we can't ask for more than where we are right now. On May 6th, Callie underwent her initial surgery aimed at repairing her forearm fractures, which required the insertion of two plates into her left radius and una. In the first weeks, Callie responded remarkably well. However, as time passed, Callie experienced increased pain as her arm swelled and developed an antibiotic-resistant infection. So we were faced with limited options. We had to make a difficult decision, amputation or euthanasia. After careful consideration, we chose to proceed with the amputation. Then, on June 4th, Callie underwent her second surgery, the amputation of her affected limb. Almost immediately, her pain subsided significantly with the removal of the broken arm and, and the infection. On June 13th, she was released into the bedroom area of her habitat, providing her with more space and comfort to adjust to life on three legs. Her transition to the bedroom went smoothly, with continued medical care by our expert keepers and dedicated veterinary staff. Over the past month, Callie has continued to heal and make impressive strides, allowing us to grant her full access to her habitat. To ensure her safety, we have modified her habitat by making it a bit smaller, adding rail railings so she can't fall down, softer grass, and extra ramps to the structures. Callie's resilience and determination is an inspiration to us all. Despite all these challenges, Callie's unwavering spirit continues to shine through. However, her journey is far from over as she still has to endure two more surgical procedures. She comes into really bad heats and she definitely needs to be spayed. And then we need to go in and do a repair on the horrific declaw procedure that was inflicted by her previous owner. Although this really cannot actually be repaired, we can go in and clean up and relieve a lot of the pain that she has in her existing front leg. Thanks to so many of you who have stepped up to make this possible for Callie, we have been able to give her everything that she needs so far. And with your ongoing support, we can continue with the next two surgeries and all of her medical care and ongoing lifetime care and everything that she, that she deserves. I cannot thank all of you enough who have stepped up and helped her so far. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And if this story doesn't warm your heart, I don't know because it's brought tears to all of our eyes. She's just an amazing, amazing cat who just keeps on giving. To learn more about lions, tigers, and bears, just visit lionstigersandbears.org.